simple as it seems The twinkle in your eyes The way that time slows down when you kiss me As we fall asleep in a bed of butterflies Just close your eyes and then you'll see it You don't ever have to Birthday to you Happy birthday to you Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you Okay, happy birthday! Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. We are in the what's it called? Mind Museum. Mind Museum. We we are going to go to the Mind Museum, which which I have been like going, which I've been waiting for since like my birthday. And um, let's take a look around. Yes. So um, that is the Pearl of the Orient. Um, what exactly is that? Yeah. What? Yes. Do you want to eat me? No. No. What kind of question is that? I don't like eating people. Wow. Cool. Rise of the archipelago. Wow. You can pause to read all of this. What is there inside? This is the South Sea Pearl. Wow. The 12 months. That's so cool. Four months. These are little babies growing. Five months? They're huge. This makes me want to grow to have some of my own. After an entire year, it looks like that. Whoa. Oh. Oh, what? Oh, with the right timing and conditions, with great with grace of nature and years of patient care, a lustrous pearl may be harvested from the oyster and a living gem is born. Just check. Where? Ooh. Wait, 
wait, I saw that thing. Are you want to go there? Yes. Okay. Where is, what is that thing? Maybe it's like some stuff about oysters and diving. I want it. It's fine, it's fine. Whoa! It's like a documentary in here! By tracing its path and speed, scientists determined that a moon lure came from roughly the direction of Vega in the okay. Lyra constellation. This implies that this unique object. Alright, the helicentric model. What is this? Why does that look so cool? Mommy, look up. Yeah. Mommy, let's go there. Whoa. Wait, what's that? What the f Oh, look. What is this? Hmm. What is what is this? Gravity to be a force attracting objects to each other. Whoa, mommy! Look. For a really long time, this idea of gravity was okay. Until 1960, when a I think clerk the at the Swiss Patent Office named Albert Einstein thought of gravity differently. Gravity as a mere force may not yet be the complete Yo. explanation. You Why does this look so or feel it, cool. But as you are attracted to the Earth, the Earth's I also know, attracted to you. The Earth that. in such minuscule ah, degrees is also falling towards you. It's an electromagnet. Thanks to Einstein uh, and his theory of but general really, relativity, without the magnets, we know now that works. gravity is not a force, but a fabric made up of interwoven wow, threads of space-time, so cool. which is bent by the mass of objects. Oh, cool. Hey, Wow. Go there. I wonder what this thing is. Oh, my. I can touch. And feel every. What is that? <laughs> I have no idea. What is this anyway? Like you're inside the uh, no? Can ah, can like you? You're inside the space station. Oh. Oh. Mommy, can you? Uh, what is this? Okay. Oh. What is this? What is this thing? Other other side. Like you're inside the spaceship. Oh. It's funny. What's that? Like that one, that's a pot. Pot? A pot? Not sure. Only one way to find the house. Okay. <laughs> they grew actual little plants in here. Yeah, they can grow in the space, right? Not sure, not actually. No, they can grow. That's real. Wow. Why does that look so weird? Hello! Alright, okay, we're out of the movie and we're immediately going back into another place. Let's go as our glass park. Whoa! What's this? A rose made of gut. What? Stay focused! Everybody stay focused! Everybody stay focused! Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> All right, let's go. We're in the new place. Lol. So what did we just do? <laughs> All right, let's go in here. Whoa. Hey. Oh. Yeah. The, uh, on the intensity scale. Yes, here's the percent of the Under faith of the That's fun. Alright, this is Okay. <laughs> wow, that thing is huge. <laughs> Hello, everybody. We are done with the experiment. Now, I answered a lot of questions. It felt like school all over again. <laughs> all over school. Anyways, we're going to um, a higher floor to oh, see. No running or to play a lot, a lot here, huh? I don't care. No, <laughs> JK. Ooh. Wow. Look at this. What's Why this? Can open it, huh? What? Can you open it? No. I thought there's something. What? <laughs> what? Ooh. What the f Crossy Road? My favorite! <coughs> Why is this level? Not up. Me. What? <laughs> what? That's not fair. That's not fair. What is this? What is this? Again. What's that? Alexander Graham. Press the numbers and listen. What? It's not working. Hello. Huh? This <laughs> is Alexander Graham Bale calling from the Bale Telephone Company. I'm just making calls to ask. Wait, early years more than that. Know how fascinated I am with some transmission. No? 
We'll just die at once so I can tell you about my early life there. Hmm? But hold on. Since we're both on this line, let me with hey, your heart conceptualize the telephone. The telegraph, which sends and receives one message at a time through a dot and dash Morse code, had already existed during my time. But my question was simply this. Is there a way that more than one message could be sent through a single wire? And the answer was yes. I developed a harmonic telegraph that sent multiple messages 